celebration. And uh, actually, it's an elopement with, with spectators. So, um, so we are just going to uh, to relax and do this informally. And uh, be, and you are part of this because you are part of the most special uh, connections that these two have. And uh, whether you're family or friends or uh, workmates or, or whatever, uh, we're glad to have you here. And on behalf of the, the Hannum and the, and the Weibel family, we, we welcome you uh, to Sunset Drive United Methodist Church. Dearly beloved, we are gathered here together in the sight of God and in the presence of these witnesses to join together Jacob Malone Weibel and Joyce Lucille Hannon in holy matrimony, which is an honorable estate instituted of God and signifying unto us the mystical union which exists between Christ and his holy church, which holy estate Christ adorned and beautified with his presence at Cana in Galilee. It is therefore not to be entered into unadvisedly, but reverently, discreetly, and in the fear of God. Into this holy estate, these two come now to be joined together. You may be seated. Jake and Joyce, I require and charge you both as you stand here in the presence of God, before whom the secrets of all hearts are disclosed, that having duly considered the holy covenant you are about to make, you do now declare before this company your pledge of faith each to the other. Be well assured that if these solemn vows are kept inviolate as God's word demands, and if steadfastly you endeavor to do the will of your Heavenly Father, God will bless your marriage. He will grant you fulfillment in it, and He will establish your home in peace. Jake, do you take this woman to be your wedded wife, to live together in the holy estate of matrimony? Will you love her, comfort her, honor and keep her in sickness and in health, and forsaking all others, keep only to her so long as you both shall live? Yeah. Joyce, do you take this man to be your wedded husband, to live together in the holy estate of matrimony? Will you love him, comfort him, Honor and keep him in sickness and in health, and forsaking all others, keep the only unto him so long as you both shall live. I do. May I have your right hand, please? In the tradition of, of sharing, of giving heart and, and covenant, uh, Jake, make your covenant now with Joyce using these words. I, Jake, take you, Joyce. I, Jake, take you, Joyce. To be my wedded wife. To be my wedded wife. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better, for worse. For better, for worse. For richer, for poorer. For richer, for poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. Till death us do part. Till death us do part. According to God's holy ordinance. According to God's holy ordinance. There I make my pledge. There I make my pledge. Joyce, let me have your right hand, and I'm going to give it to Jake, and you make your covenant to Jake using these words. I, Joyce, take you, Jake. I, Joyce, take you, Jake. To be my wedded husband. To be my wedded husband. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better, for worse. For better, for worse. For richer, for poorer. In sickness and in health, to love and to cherish, till death us do part, according to God's holy ordinance. And there I pledge my faith. Who has the rings? The wedding ring.
praying is an outward and visible sign of an inward and spiritual grace, signifying unto all the uniting of joys and Jake together through the church of Jesus Christ. May we pray. Bless, O Lord, the giving of these rings, that they who wear them may abide in thy peace and continue in thy favor, through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Jake, would you place this on George's left hand? Third thing, but hold it there and repeat after me. In token and pledge. In token and pledge. Of our constant faith and abiding love. Our constant faith and abiding love. With this ring I be with. With this ring I be with. In the name of the Father. In the name of the Father. And of the Son. And of the Son. And of the Holy Spirit. Token and pledge of our constant faith and abiding love. With this ring, I thee win. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Now, if you will join right hands together. For as much as Joyce and Jake have consented together in holy wedlock and have witnessed the same before God and this company, thereto have pledged their faith each to the other and have declared the same by the joining of hands and the giving and receiving of rings, I pronounce that they are husband and wife together. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, those whom God hath joined together, let no one put asunder. Amen. May we pray. O eternal God, creator and preserver of all people, giver of all spiritual grace, author of everlasting life, send thy blessing this day upon Joyce and Jake, whom we bless in thy name, that they may surely perform and keep the vow and covenant between them made, May ever remain in perfect love and peace together, and live according to thy laws. Look graciously upon them that they may love, honor, cherish each other, and so live together in faithfulness and patience, that in, that in wisdom and true godliness that their home may be a haven of blessing and a place of peace through Jesus Christ our Lord, who has taught us to pray together, our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. May God the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, bless, preserve, and keep you. May the Lord graciously with his favor look upon you and so fill you with all spiritual benediction and love that you may so live together in this life that in the world to come you may have life everlasting. Ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to present to you Mr. and Mrs. Jacob White.